behind you cover the 3 p.m. feedback mic where you went at 3 p.m. sun out middle of the day Ugh, worst and, mics. Then, and then you yeah, would perform and then everyone after you there perform, doesn't have a everyone job everyone would raise their hands yeah. and then give you feedback but the problem is nobody actually knew how to do comedy yeah so you just get feedback from like the dumbest people you've ever mm -hmm. and i met dalton at one of these we were both there he was wearing black camo capris <laughs> and then a pink camo athletic t-shirt oh i remember that era that was like right when his mind was starting to go crazy yeah yeah, so, yeah 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 so he's sitting in the back of the room and there's this woman that's just doing like a a set about like antidepressants and like oh i'm so depressed and i can't come and blah 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 and then dalton's feedback to this woman was like if you consult the ancient text you may find <laughs> You may find that man himself is divine. <laughs> and if you look inside yourself, you may one day cease to hate yourself. And just said the most like enlightened fire thing I've ever heard, like to the to this woman that was who amazing. had no idea. Like is it, it yeah. was amazing. It was, it was, it was yeah. fun. She goes on she, like she goes on Twitter afterwards, like, yeah, so this guy tried to assault me at a <laughs> <laughs> What? Oh, just because I said that you had nice titties at the end of all that, all you're going to ignore my philosophical he, treaties. He was dressing like a single mom at the gym, and he was speaking in Proverbs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, that's dead how he is, though. And I, I You know a podcaster that. has a mental break when they start wearing sunglasses indoors, like, every week. Oh, when you just start dressing like a blues brother every day? <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I do feel yeah. like he has a... I regained my sanity uh, through iPad Kid Magic. I watched Coco Melon and Tyler learn cognitive function again. <laughs> yeah. Don, Don I, spent, uh, I, I remember. I remember the last set I saw him do before he moved, he went back to Texas. We were. I. I. He was it the stand? Uh, no, it was at uh, Dan Wicks's Saturday night show. Oh really? At, oh, popped at, collar. At pop. Yeah. yeah. Pop collar. And uh, he was like a, he was like in front of a room. That, might, that sounds people. like a Dan Wicks fiasco. Oh yeah, you <laughs> know it was a Dan Wicks fiasco. And and uh, uh, he went up in front of like four or five people, and like one girl went on her phone, and he was like, "You do not understand the gravity of the man who is speaking on stage right oh now." Oh my God! I do remember. Do I remember that. Yeah, yeah and then, and then the? yeah, and then I like went up after, and I was like. You, you know, because you can't just like ignore someone if they get off stage. So I was like, that, not, yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> nice set, bud. Um, but yo, he's he's the man, dude. Yeah, I fuck with that guy. Yeah, that I'm glad guy. he's like he's actually a little more centered now than I, he was even when he lived well, here. Well, I mean, I'd that's say. not hard. Yeah, but, well, no, but I, it's hard to come back from New York City is a, a demon. Yeah, it and is, and, it's just one and COVID lobby. and that like that yeah. like social circle. It just was a lot. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and also like I don't know. I I relate to him a lot, dude. I I was on Adderall for so long. I started going crazy. I started having like that grandeur stuff. I started reading the ancient text. Really? And then I saw that I identified with only Dalton Pruitt, and I was like, something. I gotta wrong. get off this drug. I need to get yeah. off this pill. Wait, so I was like, were you getting manic? Oh uh, yeah, I was getting super manic. Uh, it was funny. Um, um, like I okay. Are so you bipolar? Uh, I'm not sure. I'm finding out like as we speak, basically, because I was on Adderall the whole time. So. Uh -huh. As we speak. Yeah, right I'm now. I'm, I'm not, finding I'm, out in this moment. Yeah, I'm actually. I'm, I'm, I'm like things keeping, are coming together for I'm me keeping, in a big I'm way. Keeping, I'm keeping tabs on my behavior to see if if I'm manic or or if it was just Adderall and. Um, but uh, yeah, so you know, like uh, messianic complex. Mm -hmm. I didn't have one. Right. But if you talk to me, I would be like, "Listen, dude, I was born in Israel. My <laughs> birthday is 420, which is Hitler's birthday, and everyone knows that uh, Jesus was born in the springtime. And the reason it's important that Hitler's birthday, yeah, because yeah. it's a cosmic irony that I was born on the same day. I, an asthmatic Jew, was born on Hitler Weed Day. I was like, and I was like, uh. And I was like, and I'm a chill ass, third eye open kind of guy. So basically, out of all of your friends, I have the highest probability of being the Messiah. And then <laughs> that, 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 that. Did you believe it? Um, or are you just like. So that's the thing is that I'm like a smart enough guy where I was able to, like, obviously, I'm not the Messiah. But I was literally like, yo, but out of all your friends, dude, I have the. And I stand, I stand by. Who do you know in your friend group that has a higher circle, I mean, a higher chance of being the Messiah? Than everything, than yo, you, yo. My name. <laughs> well, you, you have to, you have to understand that, like, I don't believe in Israel. So well, it's real, and it's doing a lot of stuff right now. That is uh, one really way to I pronounce can't tell it. this is a bit or not. You actually think you have a high pro you have the highest probability of anyone you know of being the Messiah? No, no, but but it, but I I don't 
like in a serious capacity. I don't in a serious capacity, but it's like how many, like if you put like boxes, are you the only check child? The boxes, no, no, <laughs> okay, no, no. wow. But no, uh, if you check yeah, out the box, do you, what, you, what, do you what only have a sister? You have my resume is are longer. You, are you an only boy? My resume is longer than uh, what? You don't have a brother, right? No, I have girls. Yeah. Okay. I have girls. It's all coming I together. I, you call them sisters. Yeah, you were the messiah of your family because you were the you were the oldest son. Yeah. No, I don't. I, I never thought that I was like. I never thought like, oh, I'm the shit. I just thought it was like a funny irony, that that you but, would but be the it, messiah. Think about your own life. How many boxes can you check off for a messiah? Uh. I don't. I've never thought about this. Exactly. This is exactly. not a. This is not I, a train well, of thought. I, I was, normal people go I was down. Born in a manger. Yeah, no, it's crazy. It's crazy. <laughs> it's very crazy. Yeah, I, 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 and I also love the evidence being like all of your friends. Like, why would I be friends with any Messiah? Like, why, yeah. why would they be in my social social Bro, circle? To prove you're the Messiah, you have to go to a Monday night Harlem Mike, mic, right, all the way up in Harlem, and you have to just go in there. And you gotta say the N word. To prove I'm not it to the us. Messiah. You have to part the I want to make it very clear. I'm not that. No, I'm right. Not. He just taxes. No, just but, but you do think that, that would you're be the a modern miracle. Fest. I'm the yeah. Like okay, like Ro just begins all of his jokes with the. Uh, so I, uh, so I, uh, <laughs> I uh, so I. So uh, I uh, <laughs> uh, uh, me. Uh, so I. Uh, Who's this for? <laughs> This is for the rowy heads out there. Rowy heads. Rowy heads. I feel like people know that's a trope of like bad open mic comedies. So I. Uh, oh, so I, I thought yeah. that was like a Jewish chant or something. Damn, you no, it's just like people. Yeah, I thought you were trying I to like stretch it and make it like Yahweh. It's like a big Brooklyn comic thing. Like, so I, uh, um, you know, like just yeah. shitty. I know like yeah. the one nothing. where it's like a little bit about me. That was the big one. Yeah, for a, while. a little bit about, about me. me. So bad. That's a TikTok thing. So a little bit about me. I think. I say I, I think, say that, I but then I say uh, it before TikTok. I say a little bit about me. I'm a I'm a new Kanye fan. I say that, oh, yeah. <laughs> and that's that gets a lot. Because yeah, you're doing it ironic. It's ironic. Yeah. A layer of irony for the intelligent audience. It's a, it's a little bit meta. Oh yeah. Oh, dude. And speaking of meta, I, there's this guy Daisuke Morimoto. He's I should have told him to come here. I'll tell him to come for the What's next his name? season. Daisuke Muramoto. Das, das, Daisuke. 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 He's an anime. Daisuke Muramoto. Yeah. Da, Daisuke? Andrew Daisuke? Andrew Daisuke. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, a, uh, hey, honey. Hey, you mother nice goose. Dick. Mother goose. Wake me up when she's a father goose. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'd really like to uh, suck off a guy right now. <laughs> oh, I'm really horny for a oh, penis. Jack and oh. Jill walked up the hill. I wish it was Jack and Jack. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hickory dickory dock. Uh, does hickory anybody have perhaps a cock I could uh, push my lips around? Hickory cock. I would suck it. <laughs> I'll do it oh, for <laughs> I'll do it for free. I'm Andrew Dice Gay, and he puts a Andrew dildo Dice in his fucking Gay. mouth instead of a cigarette. This had to have been done on Come Town or something. Yeah. Yeah. This feels like very My boyfriend uh, blindfolded me uh, the other day during sex. He used dental frost. Let's just do other Comtown bits. Okay. Uh, I'm g- I'm gay Michael Douglas. Hey, uh, uh, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm gay Michael guy Douglas. From hey, uh, uh, I'm, a, uh, I'm liberal Elmo. I'm, I'm a Jake Flores. Oh, Yo, oh, oh no, oh, dude. Fuck oh, no. I did, I did not. I did not oh, know who Jake Flores oh, was. Uh, rah, 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 rah. Yeah, yeah. I did not know who he was, but then I saw like a Twitter thread about him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About how somebody like sleuthed this, like they like like check people's Instagrams and like yeah, stories. People go do deep dives on the yeah, Jake, yeah. like it's true detective it's, or something. First of all, I feel very bad for him. That's very violating. But what was discovered about him is that uh, this dominatrix came into his house and then nailed I his saw balls that. to I a saw plank that. of wood. Yeah. They nailed his balls to a plank of wood. Uh, I mean uh, Yes. That's uh that's uh you know it's wood. No, oh are you mad that are you uh are you mad that I uh, know a woman? <laughs> 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 like, that's the kind of thing you Say. Check out the incel man oh, that I know sorry, a girl. Sorry. No one else gets as much disgusting <laughs> pussy as me. <laughs> I wonder if I'm missing. Yeah, it was hot. He says that a lot. Yeah, yeah. it was hot. <laughs> I wonder if I'm missing out on something by being like a sexually regular guy. Like I, I feel like I feel like so. by not having my no, penis, I think like most people punched, most people with something. kinks are deeply ashamed of them. I, I think yeah, <laughs> or should be. Yeah, I think the people loud about it are just like mentally ill. Yeah, normal people with fetishes. Are you talking about gay people? Yeah, I mean, I mean, <laughs> wow, no, 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 no. Uh, that's not a fetish. That's just a nice weekend in college. All right, uh, <laughs> but uh, oh, folks, <laughs> folks, all right, okay. <laughs> uh, Rodney, da- gay, gay guy feel. <laughs> 
<laughs> Rodney Gangerfield. Uh, Rodney Gay guy. So <laughs> oh, I, oh. I, got, I get no cock. I get no, no dick. cock. All right. I tried, my my friend told no me to sign up. balls. Uh, I tried to sign up for Grinder. They, <laughs> they they threw me off a rock. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. Ooh, my wife got top surgery. Now she gets no respect. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what other things gay guys do that Ronnie, yeah. d- Ronnie Gay Guy Field could talk about? Well, this does. This oh, does. Uh, take, <laughs> take my wife. <laughs> Please take my w- give me a man. Take my oh, wife. Oh, so take my I have an ex- something to tell my, my mom about why I'm, sh- I'm not married to her anymore because I, <laughs> I don't really want to have Brother. sex with a pussy. I went oh, to I Dr. Vinnie Bumbats the other day. He said HIV's progressed in the full blown AIDS. <laughs> so. It's 1993, so it's a death sentence. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like dick in my butt because I'm gay. Oh. <laughs> that's I a really great, wish prep that's a great Rodney, Rowie. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of working on my How about Rowie Dangerfield? I'm He's like, oh, I'm the Messiah, <laughs> right? Yeah, okay, yeah, I went yeah. over there and said I'm the Messiah. They no, said, how are no, you the Messiah? I said, no. hey, because I came a little early. Okay, yeah. all right. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> hey, I know oh. a prostitute and I rubbed a feet. Come on, I'm Jesus. Hey, it's oh. me. I'm Rowie Dangerfield. Rowie Dangerfield. <laughs> <laughs>